What is going on everybody? Today, I just wanted to make a quick video that is really a video that's all about gratitude and what I see going on inside of the hair system space, giving you an objective opinion from kind of the 30,000 foot perspective of what I see, what's going on, and where we're actually headed. Now, I started this channel about a year ago, just a little bit under a year ago, and at that time, there was really no one having a conversation about hair systems besides uh, Curtis over at MHE Hair, which most of us know, and uh, a couple other ones that were just getting started. Since that moment, I think things have really, really changed inside of the world. Um, you know, there was one or two creators on YouTube that was making content. There was the forums, which most of us have actually been locked out of. There's uh, two of them, I believe, and you can't really get into the forum and talk with people. So there wasn't really a place to communicate, to spread community and to build each other up and to actually engage in conversation and figure out how to move this thing forward. Since that period of time, I think things have really, really changed. I've been doing this now for over 100 videos. I think it's close to 110 videos for the greater part of a year now. And for the past really like six to eight months, been doing it every other day or well, three times a week. But that consistency, I think has, I think it's really changed the game a little bit. And I'm not saying that it's all my fault. I'm not saying that everything uh, that's happening is because of me, but I do believe it's because of people starting to show up and people starting to have the conversation. Now, a year ago, I saw some videos of guys talking about what they were doing online, uh, men who were sharing tips and tricks, and that was wonderful. What I didn't see is anybody having conversations really about hair systems. There were some about hair loss, obviously Bald Cafe and channels like that, but none that really were somewhat neutral to the different uh, modalities of trying to fix your hair loss. For me, right now, we talk a lot about hair systems, and I do that because I know a lot of you want to find out more about hair systems, to talk about hair systems, to talk about hair loss, but really, I don't care whether a person chooses a hair system, hair transplants, SMP, drugs, or whatever, shaves their head. Like I, I'm completely objective to that, and I want them to pursue going and doing that no matter, no matter what anybody thinks. But specifically inside of hair systems, no one was having the conversation about hair systems, the journey of getting a hair system, what it was like, how it was uh, scary, how it was a psychological journey, all these things. People had done it inside of the transplant space, inside of some of the general hair loss space, but really none that catered to this specific crowd. And since that moment, I really think that we've seen something happen. Um, I'm not saying I'm to blame for all of this, but we started to see creators pop up on YouTube that are sharing their story, which is amazing, which is all that we have to do is we have to keep the conversation going. You know, people like, now this is not an exhaustive list, so if I forget your name or I don't have it down, please, it's not because I don't like you or because I don't see you, I just wrote down some names quickly, but we see Esteban Rico, we see Nathan White, we see Dare to Hair, we see Sandman's Hair System, we see Hair System DIY, we see Dave's Hair System, we see Michael Joseph, we see Chris L, who was in the game before I was by a little bit, we see Jack Sims, all of these people that are starting to create content about hair systems and there's way more out there now than there was a year ago. And I think that's because what we've done as a community, not just me, but as, as a community, as a collective, we've started to actually move that needle forward when it comes to destigmatizing hair loss, destigmatizing hair systems, and making it more acceptable. Now, over the past year, it's been incredible the amount of people that have reached out asking for help, for coaching, for just some emotional support through their journey. And that's, and you know, in the day to day of creating content, um, and making YouTube videos and, you know, being part of this hair loss community. Uh, sometimes, you know, it can be overwhelming to get those messages all the time, all of the comments to respond to just about as many as I can. Uh, if I don't respond to your comment, it's not a personal front. I try to get to every single base comment. Don't reply to every single one, but I try to get to at least one, one reply in. Um, 
and it can it can be taxing exhausting you know i have a, a job on top of this right here as well as relationships as well as fitness as well as you know a bunch of different things like all of us have and it can be exhausting um and it can be it can sometimes it can feel like i'm not doing much or i'm not we're not helping the community enough and it's going slowly but what i'm seeing is a radical radical shift in what the industry conversation is what the the cultural conversation is regarding hair loss and hair systems and i just want to say thank you so much to every one of you that are viewing these videos to everyone that is commenting to everyone that is subscribing but also a special thanks to every single one of you that has put yourself out there and made videos on these topics i don't feel competitive about this space right here i don't feel like if you make a video or you make 10 videos that it's taking away from my pie there is so much more pie out there that has not been discovered there's so many more eyes out there that have not seen this type of material there are so many minds that don't believe it's possible or don't believe that it's socially acceptable to do this right here so every single time one of you makes a video every single time one of you pushes one of my videos a little bit further in the youtube algorithm by liking comment subscribing hit the notification bell below we get more and more people inside of this community that realize it's okay and that we're totally normal. And that's super exciting to me. And I think that we're about to see in the next year, in the next two years, a dramatic shift inside of the market, inside of the hair system scene, if you will, just the hair loss scene. I think we're gonna have a lot more people talking about it, a lot more people engaging in it because they're seeing all of you being brave and commenting and making videos and releasing information. Like there, there's an, no end to the work that needs to be done inside of this space. And I just wanna honor each and every single one of you for going out and being a part of that work. And I encourage you, go make a video. If you wanna share your story, go make a video. Leave a comment down below saying, hey, I just made a video on hair systems, check it out. I will go and check it out. I will go and comment. I will go and be the first like, because honestly, I'm here to support every single one of you, whether that means making videos, whether that means having a conversation with you, whether that means going and liking your video and getting some watch time on it so that way YouTube starts to push it out more. I'm here for all of that. And I appreciate every single one of you for sticking with me this long. We're only getting started. Big things are going to come. I swear they are. We are going to change the conversation. We are eventually going to have better and better products. We are going to make a huge splash in the world. And I can't wait to be a part of it. Thank you guys so much. This is just an appreciation video. That's it.